Hello, welcome to the Whitestone Dome Warranty Web Application. This video will walk you through creating your account, registering products, and submitting a replacement request. The very first thing to know is our products are covered by a limited lifetime warranty. So if you purchase from an authorized seller, and how you request a replacement depends on your purchase location. The list of authorized sellers is available on our website. For this web application, the only locations that we handle are Amazon.com, Amazon.ca, .uk, .de, .it, and .es. We also handle MobileFund.com, certain eBay sellers, and select local U.S. retail locations. For any other purchase location, please contact that seller directly. If you're not sure about your seller, please contact feedback at whitestonedome.com to find out if your purchase is covered. Now for our app. Here's the login screen. If it's your first time here, please start by clicking on Create an Account. Here you'll enter your email address. If you purchased your dome glass from our website, please enter the same email address you used for the purchase. Otherwise, your products will not register automatically. Next, fill out your first and last name and also create your password. Then, press Sign Up. You will receive a verification link to your email. Please open that email and click on the link. Once your email is verified, you can return to the login screen and you can log into your account. Also, if you ever do forget your password, you can reset your password by clicking on the blue Reset Password button on the bottom of the login screen. Once you're logged in, you will see two main sections. The top section is for product registration and the bottom section is for warranty requests. The first thing we will do is register your products. One special note, if you purchase your dome glass from our website, you do not need to register your device it will be registered automatically. Now, click on Register Your Products. Here, you will enter your order number, purchase date, purchase location, the amount you spent, and the currency. For your purchase location, if you do not see your seller on the list, please contact that seller directly. Next, you will need to upload a picture or a screenshot of your purchase receipt. Please make sure that the image includes the order number, the product name, and the order quantity. If this information does not match the info that you're requesting on your registration, it will be rejected and you'll need to contact customer service to fix it. Please do not upload any pictures of damaged devices here. You will upload those with your warranty request. After you upload the image, click on Add Product. Select the product you purchased, the variant, which is either single, two-pack, or replacement, and the quantity. You can add multiple products to the same registration if they were purchased in the same order. Please make sure all the information matches the invoice. Once you add all your products from the order, click Submit. Your registration will be saved and the status will be pending approval. Our system takes about 24 to 48 hours to process the registration request, and once it's verified, it will be set to approved and then you can request a replacement when necessary. If you look here on the right, you will notice an eye icon. If you click on the eye, you will see any notes left to you by our customer service team. There will only usually be a note if your status is rejected. If your registration is rejected, please view the note and contact customer service. Once the registration is approved, click the order number to expand the registration. Then, click on the three dots underneath the action column. Here is the request warranty button. If your registration is approved and you do not have any outstanding requests for that order, it will be blue and you can request a placement. If you do have any pending requests or your registration has not been approved, the button will be gray. Go ahead and click on the button. With this window that pops up, please verify your product and fill out the information. First, select the reason. Then, your ship to area. Here, select either US if you live in the United States, Canada if you're in Canada, 
Europe if you're in any country in Europe, and select Others if you live anywhere else. If you choose the wrong ship to area, your order will be rejected and you will need to submit another request. You can leave a note for the customer service team and you may also upload the pictures of your damage here. If you are requesting more than one glass for different devices, you must include pictures of each damaged device. Also, each unit is a separate shipping fee. Now, click Next and Process to Payment. You can pay with your PayPal account or as a guest using credit card or debit card. The system will redirect you to a secure payment portal where you can finish the payment. Fill out all the information and click Pay Now. Once your request is submitted, it will take approximately 24 to 48 hours to process and it will be shipped to you after that. That's it. If you do have any questions, please again reach out to our customer service at feedback at whitestonedome.com. Thank you. I hope this tutorial was helpful.